the Space Marine 2 multiplayer trailer is finally here. Let me lock in. Let's see what they got. Your mission is to use the store to the refinery to destroy the enemy's TV operations, trying to Kadaku. By the way, Kadaku is the most bland name for an alien planet in 40k I've ever heard. Just saying. Only when the main swarm has entered the blast zone. Okay, so this is PvE. So this will be multiplayers versus hordes of enemies like Darktide, I guess. I am honored to have Lord Titus command our unit. He has clearly served long and with distinct. Whoa, what accent is that? George Who is that at the now. front? Is that a Dark Angel at the front? What? I have been dying to carve up some Xenos. Oh! Oh my god. Okay, the first thing I will say is the melee does look quite overpowered. Because I remember they said in one of the previous trailers that they were going to make it so that you kind of have to use melee in order to charge up and do shit. But damn. Today, we slay a hive giant. Bro, this environment looks so sick. Apparently, um, from people who've actually played the, the preview, the play is actually really good. It's not like laggy or anything. So the delay was probably worth it, I guess. Oh my lord, what is that? How are you supposed to fight that? I do like how they have different sizes for the, the Tyranids, because I was afraid it was only going to be the little ones. Oh my gosh! Bro, how much health does this thing have? That thing is eating those bolt bullets. It's still alive. You guys need to lock in and kill this. Whoa. I'm not sure if I like that loading up with the hammer thing. That looks like that will get you killed in a PvP real quick. Are these dudes really still trying to kill this? These dudes are still fighting this. Is this a boss or is this just like a normal... Nah, this has to be like a boss. This surely has to be a boss. Come on, almost got it, guys. Oh, and it gives you a finisher as well. Ooh. Oh! Oh! <laughs> oh my that is amazing it actually we gives you like a mortal combat finish yeah that's definitely Take a dark angel though bro more. this jungle looks amazing the only Time thing i don't like personally is it still feels a little too linear i know this is pve and that in the pvp there'll be more wiggle room but that whole linear aspect that they had like in dark tide where you do objectives and stuff gets kind of boring really quick though love the graphics though not gonna lie what holy moly look at those dazzle graphics oh my gosh look how many there are down there wait so can you interact with like so all of these tyranids in the background can you actually interact with them like if you get close would they engage you if so that's pretty awesome my pc is crying though Hold until the swarm is in position. Oh, holy! How many Tyranids are there? Bro, that is the most cursed sound I've ever heard. What? Oh my... There is no way... Oh my god, melee against these is going to be so broken. Oh my, look at how he's actually carving through these mandos. That gun is useless, Jesus. Oh! The finisher. Wait, so in these modes, are you going to see bigger ones as well as or just smaller ones? Because they're making it seem like the bigger one is like a boss, that you meet that every now and then, but it's not going to come with the main swarm, which is a bit... I don't know, it makes it a bit less immersion. Oh, actually, wait. Maybe there are. Oh, look at that. Bro, the graphics for like the animations and stuff is amazing. The team who did this game have done so well. The game looks absolutely amazing. Look at that. Look at the scene. It captures the scale of the, like 40k so well. Oh my god. Did bro call in an airstrike? Or an orbital strike or whatever? I think he did. Huh. Excellent work. Move to extract. Nice, so that's just one of the, the PvE missions. Versus mode. 
Okay, so is this meant to be the actual PvP now? It is, okay. Bro, why are they all Ultramarines? Where's, like, the Imperial Fists? Okay, now this is what I'm after. Come on. Oh my god, these hallways look amazing. The whole gothic style is so sick. Oh, look at the detail. Like, the little, like, from Shrine to the Emperor. So it is basically like Warzone capture the, the flag. Oh my god. Oh. Oh. Is that a world eater? Oh, so I guess, like, because I'm going to react later to some of the customization I've seen from people who've played the preview. But why is there a world eater holding a tiny little gun? Bro should be having, like, a giant axe with, like, spikes and stuff on it, bro. What? Oh my god, now for Legionnaire. Yes, this is just capture the flag. Is there anything else to this? Is there any, like, 40k-esque aspect? Oh god. Oh, and you respawn in as well. Okay. Wait, so how do you actually win? I guess it's time-based and whoever has the most points wins. Pretty standard. Bro, the surroundings is so sick. Oh my god. Wait, 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 wait. So it actually lets you, like, jump over parts of the map so it doesn't, like, limit you. That is cool. That is a nice feature as well. Ah. Oh. Bro, that sniper is going to be so broken in the game, I guarantee you. And you can go invisible as well. Like what? The only thing that I don't like is the maps. As much as the maps look very detailed and they look awesome and stuff, it does look a little small. That is kind of scaring me a little bit because I feel like if it's small and you get used to the maps, you can have campers and people who game keep. Like people who spend like 200 hours on the game, they know every nook and cranny to like put their sniper and stuff. Like, I don't know. This is only one map though. I assume there's more maps. Like there has to be. Oh my god, is that Death Guard? Yes. Bro, that invisibility thing is so broken. That is so broken, what? Literally, if you don't have a teammate with you, it's kind of GG a little bit. Hmm, okay. So pretty standard capture the flag mode. I assume there has to be more PvP modes. That's not just capture the flag, like... Okay, that looks like it's all for the multiplayer. I'm gonna react to the customization later, but yeah, it looks good and I look forward to playing it. But yeah, in a bit, peace.